the Sex Pistols legend became a primary carer for the German heiress after she was diagnosed with the disease in 2018. John Lydon's official Twitter account announced the heartbreaking news today alongside a touching picture of the couple. A statement said, It is with a heavy heart that we share the sad news that Nora Forster, John Lydon's wife of nearly five decades, has passed away. Nora had been living with Alzheimer's for several years, in which time John had become her full-time carer. Please respect John's grief and allow him space. Rest in peace Nora. Heartfelt condolences to John from Rambo and All Act Pill Official. John has since been inundated with condolence messages as fans reacted on Twitter. Anne Hegerty shared a tear emoji. James Carver penned, My deepest condolences John. Rest in peace Nora, while Jerry commented, So sorry for your loss John. R.I.P. Nora. Tom added, I'm so sorry to hear this John tons of love to you family and friends. Don't miss. James Corden branded most obnoxious presenter by director, latest, axed BBC News hosts reunite with former co-star who has dropped, Twitter, the one shows Alex Jones gets TV job she's been waiting for. TV, Nora is a former actor, model and music promoter who worked with acts including Jimi Hendrix. She began her work as a promoter in Munich where she hosted a string of notable artists at her home. Nora, a German publishing heiress, used her money to financially support the Sex Pistols and other punk bands including The Clash and The Slits, her daughter Ari Ups group, after moving to London. She had met John at Vivian Westwood's clothing store, Sex, on the King's Road in Chelsea in 1975. The pair wed in Germany four years later and became legal guardians of Ari Up's twin teen boys. John, otherwise known as Johnny Rotten revealed Nora was battling Alzheimer's in 2018. The British punk pioneer lives in Southern California with Nora and serves as her primary carer some five years after she was diagnosed with the illness. He told The Times, it's shaped me into what I am. I don't think I'll ever get over it. I don't see how I can live without her. I wouldn't want to. There's no point. And, I'm sorry, but it's worth every moment. No joy comes without pain and, boy, do I know that now. i